we go. Welcome back to Remonster Anime Review, episode number nine. We're here reviewing the third to last episode of the season, Refrequent. Uh, Flagant. It looks like this one finished up chapter two of the book and partially goes to chapter three. A uh, book number three. So here's what happens. Ogbro and his group arrive at a town, which they're very hesitant to receive them due to the fact that he's an ogre. And look up the tomboy princess which proceeds to calm down. Of course, they go to the hot spring. And there's this <laughs> fanboy this type of scene where you see that all of the girls are butt naked. Don't see any naughty butts. And they have very interesting way of censoring, well, the princess where she's butt naked. By having the redhead swordswoman have her head cover her up from a distance. Very interesting. I actually thought that was a really interesting idea. Yeah, old bro and the other one not shown there. So <clears throat> they have a drink and we have a dis and we have a guy who's drunk and ends up grabbing uh Duffy's butt, which of course like if old bro was there to stop her and then oh yeah, let's have a drinking contest and they all get drunk but I think he, he can drink as much as he wants. He can't get drunk, so he's fish. He gets a whole bunch of abilities. Then on the way to, to the next town, then the sisters start acting weird. It's like, okay, do they act like, oh, we can't pair a cookie because we're not feeling too well. It turns out these two girls are pregnant with, with Oak Bro's children. Yep, that's pretty much what's happening here. So they have to get a rush to a cave, which, of course, he proceeds to give him and Daffy mask. And wear a special attire. <clears throat> and proceed to... Uh, yeah, he also basically in the comic of it, at one point... Uh, they were losing nutrients. They were basically going really thin. Like the arms were really thin. The faces were thin. Yeah, he was like, nope. Not gonna allow this. So then he proceeds to rip off his own arm. Take a piece of it. And kind of in a way force feed the girls his, 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 his blood. I mean, he only did this... Not because he wanted to eat, he wanted he wanted them to eat, and just because he wanted to, it's for them to survive. So then, of course, out of the cave, <clears throat> then he forms, from what I can tell, possibly could be, uh, um, see, uh, possibly they don't show up per se, but I'm guessing he must have formed a C-section in order to get these two babies out of. The older sister gave birth to a girl. And the younger one gave birth to a boy. Yep. And these two are, in fact, his very first two of many, many children. Yes. The girl, her name is Othro. And I believe in the anime, she's got blonde hair. And the son has got silver hair. This would make both moms be blonde. Uh, the son's name is Angato, and he also has got like this orb in his hand. Now he surmises the reason why that that is there because he's eating a lot of gems lately. So then of course he proceeds to go hunting because basically he likes to hunt. And then he comes across a basically this giant white deer he calls a stag. So he drops the animals. He was going to eat them, but wait. Let's get the children. So then, of course, he comes across a party by a minotaur. Yes, they don't call it a minotaur, even though by all appearances, that's a minotaur. And then he beats it, explains, oh yeah, my boss basically is me out here and, and compliments the guy in his fighting, gives him some potions, he can keep the carcass. And gain a whole lot of abilities. And... Then, of course, he comes back to the cave after a while. When, then, of course, the children have... Yeah, he's only gone maybe a day or two. And, and the children look like they're not, like, fresh born. I mean, the way they look, they look like they're probably about a few months old. Maybe about a year because they're already walking. He, of course, is very happy to see his children. And give them special food so they can eat. And, well, he gets a whole... He gets a good number of abilities. Then, of course, they all proceed to sleep. Daffy, of course, proceeds to sleep next to him because, basically, he's fertilized, but it's probably his wife. And then he wakes up, and, of course, then he 
how does an evolution how this hasn't happened in a while yeah last this happened was basically like i think like episode like four or five i think it was so <clears throat> he evolves into an apostle lord yes Where he is uh, shorter. Basically, description is this: he is around fifty meters shorter. He was over approximately two meters. His muscles are many more times denser, uh, the least dozen times stronger. His black skin is the same. Red tattoos by change with golden color. Uh, three horns instead of two. Sharper eyes are red, same as Dami's. And apparently, he can read a book from 15 meters away. Hair got down to his waist. And he has five demon orbs in his chest. And this is, unlike his, when he was an ogre, for a rare variant, this is an extinct species that he evolved into. He apparently can also create his own generals. Yes, seriously. It was next particular evolution that he, he basically has assumed. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's like he's in across the cave. He's, they do know he's shorter, but he's still stronger. Oh yeah, and the and the look that he went with with uh, for the anime, they went with the, with, the, with the the pose he went with in the manga, where he's like standing up and basically proclaiming his look. Yeah, they went with that. Uh, my guess is because it was kind of awkward the scene where he's woken up and he's like, oh, he's got a new evolved form. But yes, this, of course, was really, really good. I thoroughly enjoyed this episode. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep, but... That's a pretty much a particular view, but great episode. Can't wait, wait for the next couple episodes, which we have two more left for the entire season. I never get season two or not, but damn, I really enjoy this show. So that's a pretty much a particular view. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn notifications, and do not dislike button. Next up is Comic Corn, and it's on to my last anime for the evening. Too so much really fantasy, and if I get time too, which I may be able to happen, that's how I'm going to slime. Okay, next view. Bye.